Hey guys, welcome to today's deck and today in this video I'm gonna flash the latest build of the Nogat which is AOSP stable version 2 and I hope this may be the best room uh, uh, in the Nogat version of this uh, room. Uh, it released yesterday night uh, so I have downloaded it and I'm going to flash it right now. I'm using uh, Lineage OS 14.1 and it has some bugs like YouTube uh, bugs and some FM radio bugs, uh, something like that. And some tethering bu bugs, as well, Wi Fi tethering bugs also. So let me flash the USB uh, 7.1 uh, stable version 2. It claimed that uh, it has all the bugs fixed, like YouTube bugs, uh, FM radio bugs, and uh, the tethering bugs. So let me try this ROM. As always you have to go to the recovery and you have to uh, select the Dolby Cash Cash and the data. In this video I am not selecting the data uh, to show you uh, that what will happen if you do not uh, wipe the data. So uh, many, for, many of you guys have asked me regarding what uh, uh, will happen if I do not wipe the data. So let me show you what will happen. So uh, let me flash the file. I am going to flash uh, uh, the file of uh, that K3 note. Uh, my AOSP version is stable to version uh, zip file which is in my share it folder and let me go for that file so here you can see that uh, the file is here uh, kt note AOSP 7.1.1 stable to dot zip and I'm not going to flash the GFs or any other thing because it is in build the GFs in build and the super user zip as well as uh, the ROM file all together. So it's a, a big in size, it's about uh, 700 MB. Uh, so let me flash it, and uh, I think it may take a huge time because I haven't cleared the data. So let me skip this video to save your valuable time. So guys as you can see it is flashing the gapps that means gapps is in build and also the root access that you super is if also in build so you do not need to worry about the root access or any kind of uh, thing and um, but uh, here it's taking a huge time because i haven't cleared the data to format uh, the system it uh, took it over 10 minutes so that's a huge time i would say definitely uh, it's taking a huge time So guys as you can see I have successfully flashed the ROM and let me wipe the cache. Uh, so after that let me uh, reboot the system. And now let me show you if you do not wipe the data what will happen. And uh, as you can see there is no first setup screen and also the language is different. And here are some force closing issues as you can see because I haven't cleared the data. And you can see the previous ROM the apps were installed. Uh, those are also here as you can see the internet is speed monitor. And as you can see the force closing issues is <laughs> going on. That means it's now unusable. So now you know guys that wiping data is very very necessary. If you do not wipe the data then you will face this kind of problems which is really annoying. And the most annoying thing is that the language is different so I can't read this language and I cannot change the language. So let me now reboot to the recovery and let me go to the wipe section and clear the cache, Dalvi cache, data and internal storage. So let's do this. And the first boot up uh, may take a huge time so let me skip this video to save your time so here guys the first setup screen and you can change the language here uh, no really need to worry about that and the amazing thing is that all the indian languages like major languages are supported here hindi bangla marathi urdu uh, telugu everything is here so you don't need to worry about this rom every uh, language is supported here so that's a very good thing Let's get started and let me set up uh, everything here. So guys, now everything is working pretty fine here and uh, no issues at all. I haven't seen a single force closing issue after that. So that's how you can fix your ROM uh, uh, and do not forget to wipe the data. Okay. 
so this rom is based on 7.1.1 and uh, looking pretty good and it's really smooth uh, so i have to test this rom a lot more i hope maybe this is the best rom uh, of no good because i think this rom has very very few bugs so i highly recommend you to flash this rom if you are uh, going to use no good and if you want to try another rom you can uh, do this uh, lineage os 14.1 is also a very good rom and resurrection mix also is very good rom so you can go any of them but if you want very stable rom then i definitely recommend you to flash this one and guys this is the usb version rom so there is uh, very less customization so if you need customizations customizations your priority then you should i recommend you should go for the resurrection remix rom or lineage OS. so guys if you have any questions any queries do let me know in the comment section below and i will definitely try to answer as soon as possible so thank you guys thank you guys for watching and i will catch you in the next video